12 Common Signs of Hormonal Imbalance in Women Hormones are chemical messengers that control how cells and organs do their work in your body. Unfortunately, however, many people suffer from a hormonal imbalance which can cause changes in their bodies, such as developing PMS, anxiety, aching in the thighs and legs, cravings for junk foods, dry skin, thinning hair and many other issues. Your body actually makes over 50 different hormones which are released by different glands. This is what we call the endocrine system. These glands are very sensitive and they can easily cause you to have too much or too little of certain hormones when you're exposed to too much stress, junk foods or toxins from the environment. It's also very common for medications and birth control pills to cause hormonal imbalances when you've taken them for years. For this reason, today we'll be exploring 12 common signs of hormonal imbalance that show up in women so that you can be aware of what's happening inside your body. Afterwards, we'll also explore some simple yet powerful lifestyle tips that you can use to help balance out your hormones. Just a quick reminder, this video is for educational purposes only, so do speak to your doctor if you have any medical concerns. One of the most common signs is hot flashes. If you experience an intense wave of heat or warmth in your upper body, such as your face, neck and chest, this is likely a hot flash, also called a hot flush. This can also cause your skin to redden as though you're blushing and your heartbeat may speed up. Hot flashes are caused by a drop in your estrogen levels, which can affect the thyroid gland and the hypothalamus. These are very common for women who take birth control pills or are in menopause. Symptom number two is racing thoughts. If you find that you're constantly overthinking and your mind is overly active, especially at night, and it's preventing you from sleeping, this is a very common sign that your adrenal glands are releasing too much cortisol into your blood, which is the main stress hormone. High cortisol is usually triggered by mental stress and overstimulating the body with things like caffeine, over-exercising or exposure to too much blue light from screens. The third sign is vaginal dryness. Another issue that women often face is vaginal dryness and a loss of libido, especially after the menopause. This may be triggered by having low levels of estrogen or even low testosterone levels, as both of these hormones are needed in the perfect balance to maintain the health of your sexual organs. The fourth sign is sugar cravings. If you've eaten a meal and then you crave something sweet, you likely have too much insulin in your body and insulin resistance. This hormonal imbalance is triggered by eating too many refined carbohydrates and sugars for years, which makes your cells resistant to insulin so your pancreas makes more and more. Over time, in some people this can worsen into type 2 diabetes if you aren't careful. Later in the video, I'll share some tips on how to overcome these hormonal problems. If you're finding this information helpful so far, please hit the like, subscribe and turn all notifications on to stay updated with my latest health and nutrition tips. The fifth sign of hormonal imbalance to watch out for is hair loss and acne. If you notice that your hair is thinning out from the center parting of your head, or perhaps you're losing large clumps of hair in the shower, you likely have high androgen levels or low estrogen levels. This hormonal imbalance can also cause you to have oily skin, acne, and you may lose collagen in your skin faster as you age. You can balance out these hormones by eating more cruciferous vegetables and healthy fats. Coming on now to number six, which is irregular periods. Your periods should run on a regular cycle. The average is every 28 days, however this can vary between 21 to 40 days in different women. Now, if your cycles start to become irregular by stopping or starting randomly, this is a classic sign that your estrogen hormone levels are out of balance. The seventh symptom is breast tenderness. Estrogen dominance is a situation where you've got too much estrogen in your body which can cause your breasts to become swollen or tender, especially just before a menstrual cycle. This is a classic symptom of a hormonal imbalance. 
You may also experience a much heavier flow if you have too much estrogen. The eighth sign is thinning eyebrows. Now, if you start to lose the hair on the outer parts of your eyebrows or they're thinning out, this is a classic sign that you may have an underactive thyroid. The thyroid is a gland found in your neck which controls different parts of your metabolism. Low thyroid hormones can also trigger feelings of depression, dry skin, constipation and weight gain. An underactive thyroid is usually caused by a problem in your liver or your gallbladder or high estrogen. You see, these hormones are all linked to one another, so an imbalance can have a ripple effect throughout your body. The ninth sign is varicose veins. If you begin developing blue or purple veins that start to bulge or twist outwards in the legs, you likely have varicose veins. This is usually a liver problem which is causing high estrogen levels, which is also causing damage to the tone of your veins. Women who experience this often also have weight gain around their hips and thighs and they may also have a dull aching sensation in this area. The tenth sign to watch out for is facial hair. Women who begin to develop facial hair may be suffering with polycystic ovarian syndrome, a condition caused by high levels of androgen male hormones. In this situation, the voice may also become deeper and you may develop some more masculine features on your face. High androgens are usually caused by insulin resistance and eating too many refined sugars and not enough vegetables. Sign number 11 is new skin tags and warts. New research suggests that if you begin to grow clusters of new skin tags on your body, this is likely caused by a buildup of anabolic hormones like estrogen or insulin. This causes the cells in your skin to multiply too quickly and these skin tags can form anywhere on your body, especially around your neck, the armpits and some of the other folds like your groin. And finally we have number 12 which is frequent infections. Cortisol is a hormone which helps to reduce inflammation in your lungs and strengthen your immune system when it's working properly. Low levels of cortisol, however, or cortisol resistance, can cause your body to become more prone to infections from respiratory viruses, making you catch a cold more than once or twice per year. Now, if you have a mixture of these signs and symptoms, and you'd like to know the definite if you have a hormonal imbalance, there are blood test kits available for women that you can use at home. Today's video sponsor is Let's Get Checked, a company that sells home blood testing kits for female hormones. These test kits are very useful because you can do them in the comfort of your own home and then send them off to the lab for analysis using the prepaid shipping label. In two to five days, you'll get your hormone level results in the app or in your online account, which is nice and simple. If you wish, you can also request the clinical team to follow up and give you a call to explain your test results and the next steps that you can take. We've actually teamed up with this company to bring you a 25% discount on any of the different home test kits that you order. Just use the link below the video and use code RyanTaylor25 at checkout and your discount will automatically be applied. Later in this video, I'm going to share some simple lifestyle changes that you can make to balance out your hormones naturally. But first, let's take a look at some of the main triggers for hormonal imbalances in your body. By far the most common issue is eating too much sugar in refined foods, which can cause blood sugar issues that affect your pancreas and other glands that cause hormonal changes. Mental stress and strong emotions can affect your entire endocrine system and nervous system, putting them out of balance. Another issue is simply being overweight. When your fat cells are full, they can produce more estrogen and inflammation. Your glands also require certain nutrients to work properly. So if you aren't eating enough nutrient-dense food, glands like the thyroid can stop producing the right level of hormones. Not getting at least 7 to 8 hours of deep restorative sleep each night will also affect your melatonin and brain chemistry, which damages the pituitary gland. And finally, if you have a buildup of toxins in your body from smoking, drinking alcohol, soy protein, isolates, 
vaping, or taking in too many toxic vegetable oils, these can all act as endocrine disruptors, putting your hormones out of balance. Now that you know all of this new information, let's take a look at 6 ways to help balance out your hormones in a natural way. 1. Eat foods rich in trace minerals often, such as seaweed, nutritional yeast, kelp, kombu, shellfish, avocados, pumpkin seeds, brazil nuts, and walnuts. These foods are rich in essential trace minerals that support the glands throughout your body, like iodine, selenium, and chromium. 2. Support your liver in balancing out your hormones by eating bitter organic fruits and vegetables, like lemons, raspberries, broccoli, cabbage, sauerkraut, arugula, Swiss chard, garlic, artichoke, radish, and lots of raw leafy green vegetables. 3. Reduce the amount of refined carbohydrates that you're eating, like sugar, grains, flour, and wheat, such as bread, biscuits, cakes, cereals, popcorn, etc. Replace these with more nutritious whole foods, like grass-fed meats, wild fish, pasture-raised eggs, and mixed vegetables. 4. Take a daily supplement that contains 10,000 international units of vitamin D3, along with 100 micrograms of vitamin K2, in the form called MK7. This dosage helps to lower inflammation in your glands, like your thyroid, pancreas, ovaries, etc., so that they can release the right amount of hormones. 5. Eat all of your food in a strict 6-hour window each day, and allow your body to rest and digest for the remaining 18 hours. This timed eating method is called intermittent fasting, and it helps to balance out your blood sugars to allow your glands to heal and recover. And 6. Balance out your stress hormones by taking long walks outside, in areas where there's lots of nature and trees. The fresh air, gentle exercise, and the essential oils released from treetops will help to turn off the fight or flight response in your body, which may be putting your hormones out of balance. There are also certain vitamins and nutritional supplements that you can take to help normalize your hormones. So go ahead and tap on this video on the screen now to learn more about these. Thank you so much for watching my video today, and as always, I wish you great health, wealth, and happiness.